Welcome ladies and gentlemen, we are back today with a new Champions League campaign following Barcelona as they look to regain that title that they won two years ago. So we've got the highlights from the first three group stage matches. First up is the away leg against Spartak Moscow. Have a look at the team for today. Spartak playing at 4-5-1, hoping to somehow contain this Barcelona side that scores goals for fun, it feels. And looking at the away side, very strong team. 4-3-3. With Sanchez, Messi and Pedro up top. So we move into the 21st minute. Not a lot of action, to be honest with you. Both teams struggling to create chances. The ball was whipped in. It's cleared away. It's Messi with the flick on header. It was Iniesta looking for that ball over the top to Sanchez. It was a lovely pass. It was Alexis Sanchez. He skipped round the challenge. It was one on one. That was a massive save to deny him. 29 minutes played. Barcelona finally finding some little bit of uh, rhythm. It was Xavi. It was this Xavi with a strike off the post. It came back towards Sanchez and Sushi did well to deny him. But have a look at this strike. Wonderful effort. So close to make it a 1-0. Move into stoppage time now. It was Lionel Messi. Playing around with it, looking towards Pedro. Pedro back to Messi who was just on site. He still had a lot of work to be done and Lionel Messi makes it 1-0. Easy as that. And Barcelona, what a time to score. Right on the stroke of half time. A little Argentine. Played a 1-2 with Pedro. You can see just on side. The hands went up, but there was no doubt about it. And he still a lot of done. But it was a cool finish. Quick look here from another angle. Just opened his body up. Slotted it home. So at half time, it was Sparta Moscow nil, Barcelona 1. Pushing into the 46th minute straight after the break. Thiago came on. He was put through. And what a chance for him. He was 1 1 with the keeper. But it was another big save to deny him. Well, what an introduction that would have been. Been on the field less than a minute. Nearly scored. 53 minutes gone. As Thiago reverse pass towards Jordi Alba. Little Messi wanted it in the middle. was whipped towards him. Went through his legs. Ball came back out to Thiago. Danny Alves. Danny Alves with the strike. And it was punched away. 57 minutes now. Finally, Spartak Moscow coming forward. Kalström with a chance, laid it back. Ball came to Jubo with a strike, took a massive deflection, and Victor Valdez just got a hand on it to deny it. Look at that massive deflection off Danny Alves and hit the post. 74 minutes gone. It's Messi. Always, always looking a threat to Thiago Silva. Thiago, shall we say, not to Thiago Silva. To Sanchez. It was good feet by him towards Lionel Messi. Messi with the turn and the strike. Just over the bar. And what a chance it was. Good play from Sanchez. Nice little Cruyff turn into Messi. Just couldn't keep it down. 86 minutes played. Barcelona holding on. It was Jordi Albert to Villa. Made it inside to Xavi. Xavi tried to get in there, took a deflection, and it was Thiago having a go. But uh, that was never troubling the keeper from 45 yards out. The ball flying straight into the fans. So, 89 minutes played. The ball came into Villa. The ball was chipped over the top towards Lionel Messi, who we know is quick. He had the pace, he had the skill, and he had that for a finish absolute class picks up his second goal of the game and the way he scores it just phenomenal a 
can see here. It's a lovely ball over the top. Accelerated away. But look at this. Right foot finish over the looping keeper. You can see here in slow motion as well. Look at the way he just gets it up. Gets taken out, but it doesn't matter. Because the keeper was just watching. As it looped into the back of the net. And secured the three points for the Spanish side. So that's how it finished. Sparta and Moscow nil, Barcelona two. Have a look at these shots. One shot for Sparta and Moscow. Just did not show up today. Barcelona just dominating. The new man of the match for today. There's no doubt about it, it's Lionel Messi. Quick look at the other results. Celtic losing 1-0 against Benfica in Group G. In Group H, Galatasaray losing 1-0 to United. Braga 1, Cluj 0. Porto 2, Dynamo Zagreb 1, PSG 3, Dynamo Kiev 2. Schalke 1, Olympiacos 3, Montpellier beating Arsenal by goal to nil. St. Petersburg 1, Malaga 0. And AC Milan losing 1-0 to Anderlecht. Man City uh, beating Real Madrid 1-0. Borussia Dortmund 1, Ajax 0. Group E, Juventus 1, Chelsea 0. And Shakhtar Donetsk 3-2 winners. And Group F, Valencia 0, Bayern Munich 3. And Lille 3, Bate 0. Look at the table. Barcelona top, Benfica second, Celtic and Moscow still with no points. So it was Celtic who were up next for Barcelona at the new Camp. Barcelona with that somewhat impressive away win against Spartan Moscow in the first game will be your clear favourites for today. Can the Scottish side cause an upset? Let's have a look at Barcelona. 4-3-3, very much similar to the last game, but Song comes in for Xavi. 4 Celtic playing a 4-4-2. Got Lassad and Anthony Stokes up top today. Commons on the right, Ledley on the left. Move on into the fifth minute. Iniesta with uh, some great control and good power to get away from his man. Led it towards Alex Song. Alex Song with a strike. But it always creeping just wide. The former Arsenal man. Decent strike. Good start for Barcelona. Moving on to the 19th minute. It's Danny Alves. To Iniesta. Good players who skip round the challenge. Found Jordi Alba. Looking towards Pedro. Trying to find Sanchez, but it didn't happen. It was a poor pass, though. It was NG Iniesta with a strike. Good save. Cleared away. 25 minutes gone. Song with a poor pass. There's Brown. But Song getting in the way of the game. And Lely gets back. 1-1 one -on -one with PK. PK does well. Just gets. Towards Messi. To Iniesta. Iniesta looking for that through ball. It was a mistake from Wilson. Who led Pedro 1-1 -on -one with the keeper. And he made it 1-0. But what on earth was that? Poor defending, lapse of concentration. And with the quality of Barcelona, there's only one outcome. Messi laid it inside to Iniesta. It wasn't a great ball through, but Wilson just gets completely all, all over the place, to be honest with you. Straight through his legs, wasn't catching Pedro. Still a great finish. From 18 yards, Barcelona. Took a 1-0 lead. So I move on into the 32nd minute. The Spanish side looking to extend that lead. It was Puyo. Towards Iniesta. Still coming forward. It was good feet by him. Iniesta cutting inside. Andres Iniesta with a strike. Good save from Forster. It was cleared away. 
37 minutes gone. Now yeah, Danny Alves, look at this. Skip round one, two, three. Still going, Danny Alves. Later back to Messi. Good block. And then the strike from Sanchez was just wide. But have a look at this from Danny Alves. Skip round one, two. Carried on going. Skip round a third one. Lays the ball back to Messi. The strike was blocked. And Sanchez couldn't follow up. So at half time, Barcelona 1 0 lead. Dominating so far. Celtic looking to come out of the blocks early. They really struggled in the first half to even maintain possession. And here will they come forward. Lustig now. Rudy Alba got in front, but Lustig did well. The ball was whipped in. There was a chance for Stokes when it was comfortable for Pinto. 57 minutes played. It's Busquets finds Villa. Was playing around with it. It's careless play. It was a chance. The ball was whipped through to Anthony Stokes. One on one with Pinto, but that was a tame strike in the end. 66 minutes gone. Wilson, Lassad. Good challenge from Busquets. And he put the ball through to Pedro. It was a lovely pass. Celtic caught Nappy once more. It was Pedro, and it was 2 0. Cool as you like. And Celtic's defence split wide open. Today the defending just hasn't been good enough. It was a lovely ball from Busquets who won the challenge initially. Great ball through. He had the pace. Took two or three touches. And with his weaker foot just steered it past Forster. To pick up his second goal of the game. 2-0. So 72 minutes gone. Celtic now with the corner. Commons whipping it in. Cleared away. Anthony Stokes with another strike. He's had a few chances this half. Pinto once again easy for him. Barcelona now looking on the counter. It was Busquets, Danny Alves towards Villa. Into Messi. Twisting and turning. Lays it back out to Villa. When Yama came across. Villa laid it back towards Lionel Messi. And there's 3-0. How about that? Quick counter, precise finish. And it's just your typical Barcelona move. Messi twisting and turning out to Villa, who done really well to come inside. No one was marking Messi, and he takes one touch, but the finish. Sweet as a nut. Past the outstretched Forster, who was left with no chance. 3-0. So 81 minutes gone now. Barcelona looking to extend that lead once more. Jordi Alba up the line towards Pedro, of course, on course for that hat trick. To Iniesta. It was Andres Iniesta was punched away. Matthews cleared it. Now into stoppage time. It was Pedro to Messi. Messi, who was just instrumental in this game towards Villa Villa 1-1 one one and he's made it 4 he grabs his first of the game and Barcelona today just looking in sensational form another sweeping move Pedro to Messi Messi comes across lays the ball through Villa takes 3 touches and scores clinical as you like. One final look here from another angle, and you can really see just smashes this across Forster, leaving him with no chance. And that's how it finished Barcelona 4, Celtic 0, match day 2 of the Champions League. 13 shots to 4, Celtic just couldn't keep a hold of them. Your man of the match was Pedro. So a quick look at the other results, Benfica 1, Spartak Moscow 3, United 2, Braga 1, Cluj 1, Galatasaray 0, Dynamo Zagreb 0, PSG 2, Dynamo Kiev 0, Porto 0, Olympiakos 1-1 one, one against Montpellier, Arsenal losing again against Schalke 1-0, Malaga 0, AC Milan 1, Anderlecht 1, 
St. Petersburg 2, Real Madrid 2-1 winners against Borussia Dortmund, Ajax 1, City 1, Chelsea 2, Shakhtar Donetsk 0, Norschlagland 0, Juventus 3. And finally, Bayern Munich 1-0 against Lille, Mbappe 0, Valencia 1. So look at Group G, Barcelona comfortably atop with 6 points, Spartak 2nd, Benfica down into 3rd. So the uh, match day number three of the Champions League now. Barcelona at home again. Up against tough opposition. The Portuguese side of Benfica. Hoping to get another win under their belt. Look at Barcelona. A couple of changes. Adriano coming in and Abidal. For today, no Iniesta as well. He is on the bench. Looking at the Portuguese side, currently lying in third in the table. We'll be hoping for anything today at all. 4-2, Rodrigo and Cordoza up top. So, seven minutes gone. Barcelona hoping for a good start. It was Song to Xavi. It was a lovely ball towards Sanchez. Sanchez, one-on-one, -on -one looking for that far corner. Just couldn't find it. He knew it was a chance. The movement was phenomenal. Look at the run here from Sanchez across the back line. Takes two touches looking for that far corner. Ten minutes played now. It's Benfica with Gatan. To Martins. Skip round the challenge. Lovely ball back to Gatan. And he just got it all wrong, didn't he? And he knows it was a chance. You don't get many against Barcelona. And that was a real one. Martins did well. Skip round one challenge. Lay the ball through. Gatan couldn't score. 25 minutes gone. The corner cleared away. Xavi towards Abidal. Song towards uh, Adriano with a good strike. Parried away. Header clear for a corner. Xavi to take. Picked in towards Alex Song with a header. But he couldn't keep it down. Good delivery. Just couldn't keep the ball down. 39 minutes played. Xavi coming forward. He found Song. Back towards Xavi, who's always an instrumental figure. Great ball out wide to Abidal. Needed someone in the box. The ball was whipped in towards the near post, but Artur was there. So a goal this first half. Barcelona nil, Benfica nil. Straight off the bat, it was uh, Benfica coming forward. Cordosa with the header. Straight after half time, Benfica with a chance to go in front. It was a good save from Victor Valdez. A corner for Benfica. Whipped in towards the near post, cleared away. It was Pedro to Lionel Messi, who really was kept quiet the first half. As Messi was keeping possession did really well was waiting for more support made it square to uh, Adriano who took a good touch it was a wonderful strike and I tell you what it's a massive save because that was heading in the top corner Lionel Messi gets absolutely clattered there the referee played the advantage it was a good one it was a fine save look at Messi took a knock the referee didn't opt to uh, issue a yellow card you have a look at the challenge it definitely was a bookable offence. So 56 minutes played. It was Pedro. Twisting and turning in the 18-yard box. Did well. Looking for Lionel Messi at the back post. He couldn't get there. Sanchez would. To Adriano. Square ball to Alex Song. Song with a strike. But once more, Barcelona getting frustrated. Just couldn't penetrate this Benfica defence. Still find themselves goalless. Decent effort. It's not good enough. So 70 minutes gone. Now Benfica's time to come forward. It was Bruno Cesar. He's coming inside. Laid it towards Rodrigo. It was a lovely pass. Cordoza. Oh, what a chance for Cordoza. 
And he knows it. Benfica's best chance of the game by far. Lovely move. But the finish was lacking. There were 88 minutes played. Time was running out for both teams. It was Alex Song. Towards Lionel Messi. That was a wonderful turn from Messi. And what about that for a finish? When you lead a little bit of magic. The world's number one steps up. Four goals in three games in the Champions League. And this is just pure class. It's a great header from PK. Song picks it up. But look how quick he turns his man. So precise. And that finish. Lethal. And rightly so. Praying to the gods. I'll have a look at this in slow-mo. Look at he just skins the defender. Takes two touches. And then rockets it. Past Artur. And that's how it finished. Barcelona stealing the 1-0 win. Grabbing nine points from nine. Nine shots to four. And your man of the match for today was Adriano with a 7.5. Looking at the other scores, Celtic picking up a point against Sparta at Moscow. United winning 3-1 against Cluj. Galatasaray 1-0 against Braga. Dynamo Zagreb 0. Dynamo Kiev 1. Porto 1. PSG 2. Olympiacos 1-1 one, one against Arsenal. Arsenal really struggling. Schalke 0. Montpellier 1. Group C, Malaga 1, Anderlecht 1, St. Petersburg 2, AC Milan 2. Group D, Real Madrid 3-1 winners against Ajax. City 1, Bruce Dortmund 1. Group E, Chelsea losing 2-0 at home. What a shock on the cars. That is Juventus 0, Shakhtar Donetsk 0. And Group F, Bayern Munich drawing with Bate. Valencia 1, Lille 0. So, a final look after the third match here. Barcelona comfortably at top of the table. Spartak Mosto stay second. Benfica stay third. Celtic in fourth. Hope you guys enjoyed it. That was the first three games of the group stage. We will be back, of course, with match days four, five, and six. But until next time, be sure to rate, comment, subscribe. Please do hit that like button if you enjoyed it. I'll see you guys next time. Take care.